Hey, good morning, everyone. It's Merry Christmas. Huh? Merry Christmas. Um, Advent Sunday, the last Sunday, actually, before Christmas. Let's remember, this is about Christ came and that Christ will come again, but also that Christ comes through all of our lives by the way we love and serve and give ourselves to others. So I want to encourage you that today in that um, I'm also just want to remind you of my message last week. I literally had to look up my notes. It's weird how you'll forget what you spoke, but I asked the question, why did God come? And I ended that message with the answer to bring hope to the weary world that we might rejoice. And remember, rejoice is this expressing of ecstatic joy. So I'm just believing that God will just give you the gift of just being able to rejoice uh, even in this crazy year. Um, and so many people have gone through so much. But um, I suppose there's nothing more important than um, the realization that God came to us, Emmanuel, and that God is with us, continues to be with us. I want to remind you in Joshua 1.9 that God speaks to Joshua and he says, Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. Amen. Thank you, Darla. Merry Christmas to all of you and your families. And uh, I know my mom and dad, Godwin and Glennis, and their greetings as well. Merry Christmas to all of you. And we just wanted to come uh, and into your home this morning and tell you that we really, really do love you. And despite the circumstances, some even in our uh, church family this week went through just horrific uh, situations. But we want all of you to know that not only do we love you, the Lord loves you, and we've been praying for you. And we pray that these particular uh, set of holidays would create some unusual and good memories for you, that you would pull your family close, that you would speak the words of love over them. Today is a family service. We do it every year and our kids pastor will be sharing a brief message coming up in just a few minutes but we wanted just to come online and tell you how much we care and love you and uh we're grateful for the gift that jesus brought to us and we pray that you'll receive that gift where you are yes our hope for you this season from our family to yours is that as you gather around hopefully some family or maybe a friend or two um, this christmas season this christmas week uh, that you would feel the love and joy of Jesus and the peace that passes all understanding, that that would be a part of your home and a part of this holiday season. Yes, and as we celebrate this Advent season together, I hope that um, you will all take a little bit of time to reflect on how Christ has found you this year, in this season, today, and uh and, and fully embrace um, with full gratitude everything that Christ has done for us and has given to us. Uh, we love you guys. Merry Christmas. I hope you all have a great holiday uh, this season. I've got to say Merry Christmas to Blake, the grandbaby. So Merry Christmas, Blake, if you're watching. We She's love watching. you and we love you all. Merry Christmas to all the kids. God bless you.
Yosef. We're so thankful for you. We love you. We're going to sing this together. All glory to him this season. Christmas.